What's up everyone? I'm Tamara and today we're going to talk about narcissists pit people against you and they are fantastic at this. Some of them are experts at it because they thrive in it. They've been doing it their whole life. Have you ever had anyone to pit you against someone and you just thought this is so weird. You're spending all your time trying to make us upset with each other. I remember once having to be around this group of ladies and one of them was a narcissist and there were these other ladies who were always so mean to us, me, her, and another lady. And I finally asked the narcissist, why are they always coming for us? And she said, oh no, 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 they love you. They're coming for the other lady because I can't stand her. So that's why I'm always buying them pies. And she cracked up like, isn't that so funny? And I'm like, not really because I'm in the crossfires of all of this and I've done nothing. But that's how smooth and slick they are. I didn't even realize that she was the mastermind behind why they would always attack us. But it was because the narcissist did not like the other lady who she often used for things, needed to help her, needed her to give her expertise, do this for me, do that for me. And then she was sucker punching her. So narcissists can be really bad about that. And a lot of times it's from perceived slights. It's not even really a slight. So if you try to explain to them, hey, this is what's really going on, they're not gonna see it. They're gonna be stuck in their perceived slight that they've made up about this person and now they're mad because they are hyper sensitive. They can be quite sophisticated at pitting people against each other. You may not have any idea. Some of them show no evidence. It's interesting. I remember a scenario where one guy was always attacking certain people, but it wasn't him. It was a narcissist who would smile at those people, be very kind, be very sweet, seem to want to be their friend, and yet he was sucker punching his friends behind their back. What kind of friend is that? He really wanted to keep those quote unquote friends to himself. He didn't want the guy who was attacking them to get close to his people. So he would set up Mr. Attacker to go after these friends all the time. So it kept the guy who was always jumping on people and yelling at people and disrespecting them and putting them in their place. It kept constant friction between him and the people that the narcissist wanted all to himself. And I just watched all this happen and I was like, duh, wake up, you're being set up and used to be a villain. And I personally know it's not you, it's the other guy. Because the other guy would always say a little something that would give like a subtle hint that he was the one who really had an issue or a problem with something. But they're so slick. They are so smooth and glib and they cause so much tension, frustration, anger between so many people. It's just ridiculous. So you have to be careful if there's somebody that's always jumping on you, attacking you. You might have to look and say, is it really this person or is it a narcissist that's behind this? Because a narcissist, you could tell what's hyping up the guy like, don't be a wimp, you gotta stay on them, you gotta be tough. So then that guy doesn't wanna seem like a wimp. So he's gonna show out in front of the narcissist. It's amazing how many people show out, by the way, in front of narcissists. It's interesting. They go from being their sweet selves to, I am so tough. So the narcissists, they are puppeteers or puppet, they puppet people. 
that's what they do. They're very good at that. So be careful with that. If you're ever with a narcissist, don't let them pit you against other people. If you want to know more about narcissists, check out my book, The Workplace Narcissist by Tamara Hunter Zion. It's on Amazon. And I think you will find some really helpful strategies for getting around these very difficult people. So thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Let us know in the comments if you've ever been pitted against someone. Bye.